you know, I'm really getting tired of the government. Of the government. Because I just feel like everything that previous presidents have done to help the middle class, even the lower class Americans, they are wiping it away. I don't know if it's Republican base, Democrat base, independent base, or whoever. I don't know. Uh, politics is really not my thing, so I won't really speak on it. But I will say this. My money makes money. This is Ross World. Myra. We talked about it before. We talked about it before. It's my retirement account. It's an account. It's an organization under the Department of Treasury that Obama made to bridge the gap to lower class and middle class Americans to have their own retirement account. Now, some of these jobs out here. Now, I know a buddy, he works at UPS. Well, the type of job he has at UPS because he's not on a certain level or status or position, they don't offer him a retirement account or IRA or anything, not even stock options. So Myra was that bridge to gap the lower class and middle class to even, in some cases, high class. Now, Myra allowed you to put money or take money, rather, away out of your account up to $15,000 and once you reach $15,000, you had to take that money out and transfer it to something else. This was just to start you somewhere. Now, some of you are saying $15,000 is not a lot of money. And it really isn't. But to somebody who is not saving money, who doesn't have money saved up, this is a lot of money. Especially as you're getting older, you don't have a nest egg. You don't have anything to fall back on. So the Myra, my retirement account, under the Department of Treasury that was initiated under Obama, it is shutting down September 15th. Let me say it again. September 15th, 2017. That is this Friday, ladies and gentlemen. This, that is this Friday. So if you already haven't received the email or a letter in the mail and you have your money in the Myra account, go ahead and check out their website and follow instructions on there because... They're, lo they're no longer supporting it. They're no longer supporting it because it, it costs you absolutely nothing. But you was getting return on your money because they were using your money. They were using your money to invest. Now, I don't know why they're shutting it down. But I can tell you, it's probably two or three reasons why they're shutting it down. And yeah, I could have did the research. But for this, I'm like, no, I'm not going to do the research because I can't believe they're doing this. But. Nevertheless, here are the reasons why I think they're shutting Myra down. First and foremost, they're not making money off of you. They're not making money off of you. Okay? They, you put your money in there. Uh, maybe they're not making the greatest return as they thought they were. So now they're like, oh, it's costing us more money to run it than us making money off of the public. That's one. Number two is they have not accumulated the numbers that they thought they would have when first thought of this program, when they first initiated this program, when they first started this program, they're like, okay, you know, it's 350, 360 million Americans. We should have at least 2 million Americans because of the poverty line, because of the lower class line, because of the middle class line, and those companies that do not offer retirement accounts, okay? So they're like, yeah, this is going to be a good thing, especially when Obama came into office. Now, I, I, I'm not privy one way or another, but it, I believe that it was a good option. That's why I put the information out there. But once again, they're shutting it down September 15, 2017. That's just Friday. So those are my reasons why I think they're shutting it down. And of course, it could be some political bureaucracy about blah, blah, blah. Who knows? But if you know somebody that's in it, or if you was even thinking about it, it's going to be over. It's going to be shut down. You can't even get inside of it. There's, and this is the thing. There's no grandfather clause, okay? So if you're thinking that, oh, they're going to shut it down, so let me hurry up and get, in, get involved and put my money in there. No, 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 no. They are shutting it down. It's kind of like Kmart. Remember you know that one time you went to Kmart and you was like, man, I like Kmart for towels or rags or whatever. And then when you went like, when did Kmart shut down? 
when did Kmart go out of business? Or, or you was like, man, I really like that Bojangles chicken. Bojangles, right? Bojangles. Now, in DC, Maryland, Virginia, I think there's still a Bojangles over there by Iverson Mall. But anyway, <laughs> I remember when they shut down Bojangles. That's a chicken joint, guys. A chicken joint, right? Kind of like churches, but their biscuits are better. And I was like, what happened to Bojangles? They shut down Bojangles. So that is exactly what's happening to Myra. They're shutting it down. This is Ross World where uh, I just wish that President Trump will come up with a program similar to that, better than that, to help bridge the wealth gap for those who are out there working their ass off will have the opportunity and the chance to save for their retirement. I'm out.